Now that you've hacked your switch, I'm gonna be showing you how to be able to play Sonic Robo Blast 2 on it, okay? <clears throat> so, you know how to drag stuff into the root of your SD card, you know where the homebrew apps go in the switch folder, okay? So, you go ahead and go to here. It shows the latest version, and yes, it's compatible with PC as well. It might take a little while to port over like the new version onto Switch, but nonetheless, they still have did it up to this point, so I really appreciate them. <clears throat> so you go ahead and download this. Let it download. Now that it's finished downloading, I'm gonna go ahead and open it up. Extract it to uh, the root of your, well, really, just whatever you put your downloads, it doesn't matter. Okay, so we go there. Go ahead and go to the files. Okay, here we go. Sonic Robo Blast 2. You go ahead and drag this to the root of your SD card. The root of your SD card will always show your main files. And if you're using your actual Switch SD card, it'll also show the Nintendo folder. Don't worry about that. That's just like your saves and like your games that you got downloaded on your Switch and on your SD card. Um, I really wouldn't mess with that unless you're going into the album folder because you don't want to mess up any of like your saves that you have. But you know, this is me. Alright, you go to the switch folder. See, look, here you go. It's in its own little folder right here. Got everything that it needs. Alright. Oh, and uh, just to let you know as well, um, you can use mods on this junk as well. But some of the mods aren't compatible with Switch. I've tried Bowser is a perfect example. It doesn't work for me. It just crashes the game. Um, but yeah, but aside from that, everything else really works. Like you know, Shadow, Silver, Mario and Luigi, Yoshi, Kirby, you know, all that stuff. It works even um even like the level the level mods. Um, one that I don't that I don't uh, recall working is like the Sonic 06. It, it worked it booted up but like the textures was a little like warped it was like red so i mean i really wouldn't call that a win but <laughs> hopefully they make it compatible as well so all we can do is just hope okay here got my sonic robo blast i'll go ahead and show you exactly everything that i have in here now just to let you know when you play online and you choose to play with mods um if the server has their own mods it'll be automatically downloaded onto your switch and it'll be located in the downloads folder um it'll be a lot of outdated mods so just make sure you get rid of them um yeah it even shows everything see i, I set it up a little personally because Sometimes I just want to use the characters. Not the, like not like everything that comes with it. See, here got this right here. The Mario Bros. Sonic. Samus also doesn't work. I tried. Well, not on Switch, of course. So yeah, you got everything. You got the Bowser mod I was telling you about. Mario Bros. Can make all these all this good stuff. These work perfectly fine. Like modern Sonic. Sometimes it crashes the game, but it really depends on what I do. Okay, this is everything shows all of my saves hey oh and also if you play on pc you can just it's the same file setup you can just take your save from your pc and just drag it onto your switch and basically you can just go back and forth with you know if you really wanted to i i, I personally don't do that because i don't play on pc but this is just good if you wanted to try it out okay Better be ready for war. Better be ready for war. I'm with the father, so know that it's dirty for sure. <laughs>